planet Earth, our home. Constantly bathed in the vibrations of the cosmos, rippling down to affect even the simplest metamorphosis on our planet, ever progressing in a cosmic pattern of change. Yet, even as we're surrounded by these seasons of transformation, there is one thing that remains constant. Still Point. I started using the laser the morning after surgery, and I had um, three incisions, and at those incisions was where the therapist would massage every day when she came before we did our exercise engine. And she said, well, in every patient I've ever worked with, you always have ropey scar tissue behind this, the incisions, and you have none. And she said, it's got to be the laser. I had developed fused vertebras from playing violin with bad posture for nine years. When I found the scalar laser, magically it started dissolving the pain, and now it's completely gone and has not returned in two years. We understand that the body, every seven or eight years, is totally new. The eyes, they say, two days you have totally new eyes. The question then becomes, well, gee, if the body is new in seven or eight years, why would anyone have an injury going back 10, 15, 20 years? And what folks started to come up with was this thing called cell memory. So someone would get a knee injury or a shoulder injury, and that information from the injury we'll call the cell memory. New cells would keep coming in, but that old cell would pass that information of that injury to the new cell. Now the new cell, vibrant brand new cell, starts behaving and acting like the old cell. All lasers donate energy and stimulate cells to regenerate. It's the first mantra of our seminars, is that cells love to grow. The only thing the body does, period, is to grow new cells. It's the only thing the body does. Well, I use the analogy of a garden. To me, a garden is a great way to describe how this principle works. Because what do you do when you plant a garden? You find an area where there's sunlight. And then you prepare the soil and you plant your garden in the sunlight. Why? Because the sunlight delivers photons. And those photons, in turn, go into the plants, the fruits, the vegetables, the leaves, what have you. And they increase the ability to grow big, healthy fruits and vegetables. Laser therapy works the exact same way. They don't cut, they don't burn. What they do is they donate energy. Lasers are effective because they donate photons. Those photons increase the part of the cell called the mitochondria to produce more ATP, adenosine triphosphate. ATP is energy. It's a fancy word for energy molecule. That's all it is, it's an energy molecule. And that energy molecule in turn drives 70 to 80 percent of the cell's activity. Well, in February of 2009, I had some extensive surgery done, and I was worried about developing adhesions because that can cause um, a lot of pain long term. And only a few weeks later, I found out about the laser, and so I got one, and I used it almost exclusively for about a month. Um, I ran it three or four times a day right over the surgery, surgery area and I'm happy that I didn't get any adhesions at all and the surgery healed up really quickly and really well. No scar tissue. So I'm very happy with it. First came in contact with the laser uh, through my son and our good friend Jennifer and first I used the laser on myself for my left shoulder pain, a fractured left foot, um, muscle spasms and what have you. It worked very well for myself, and I decided to use it on patients. Now, I also like to be clear with the difference between our laser and other lasers, because there are some key differences. Our laser uh, uses multiple wavelengths. Most laser companies use red, and then the next batch use infrared. Red is good from my standpoint on surface cells. Red does not go in as far as infrared, so they're great for skin, soft tissue, muscle, nerve, meridians. Infrared lasers are also good. The length of the wave makes them not visible. Infrareds go much further into the body. To me, they're much, much more effective for bone, tendon, cartilage, disc, for neuron, brain cell activity. Our, our company, we use red, we use infrared, and we use violet. 
Most companies do not use violet lasers because violet laser diodes are very expensive. To me, they're fantastic because they do a very unique thing. Violet light holds way more information than red or infrared. Well, for example, the newest Blu-rays, the newest game things are all using blue. Blue. They've switched from red to blue. Why? Because blue holds more information than red in the color spectrum. Well, violet is beyond blue. Violet holds a ton of information. What we do is we have a processor in there and we're actually uh, first creating these nice rounded sine waves, but then we're taking lots of different waves and using very subtle refined information within the light to induce the body to relax, dissolve, neutralize what we call quantum, the quantum uh, part of the technology. And the scalar part is designed to neutralize and dissolve polarity, to dissolve cell memory and allow the cells to relax and expand into neutrality. We live in a huge ocean of space. Now, planet Earth has had an electromagnetic field, polarity. Body, emotion, thoughts, cell memory, all that stuff is polarity. It's information. So by practicing resting in neutrality, we call it still point. We don't hold on to that stuff. I'm a chiropractor by trade, but retired because of an injury. Recently, I was invited to come to the uh, Still Point Quantum Wave Gathering, and I began to use it. This is the third time, and uh, last night after I got home, I had so much energy, I decided to take a walk. I went around a quarter mile in record-breaking time, and then I remembered that I haven't been able to walk a quarter mile in about the last six months because I had torn my patella and Achilles tendons in both knees and both ankles. So I wanted to say thank you, and I think it's a great thing, and I guess this is gonna be in the next office I have. I'm taking one home. Another one, my father came for Thanksgiving. He's a 76-year-old man. He's tripped and hit his arm uh, on, a, on a glass table uh, while I was gone. So when I came back, my husband said, oh, your dad fell, and uh, when I looked, he had a, a hematoma this, uh, the size of a grapefruit, and it was raised up probably at least an inch off the skin. I put it on Unwind, Quantum, Relieve, and Pleo, and when we removed the laser, it had a, an actual imprint that was, that was white, and there was, no, there was no redness or anything, except for maybe the little place where he had bumped, and then underneath, uh, there was just a little bit of black and blue. So my dad was amazed as well. He used the laser for a year and a half, two, y la, los resultados que he tenido han sido maravillosos, soy terapeuta. Eh, a nivel personal, cuando sufro de insomnio, eh, puedo usar el programa para dormir e inmediatamente me quedo relajada y regreso a dormir. Los resultados en general a nivel de estrés con el resto de las personas que trabajo son muy impresionantes porque realmente Puedo darme cuenta cuando trabajo para relajar el sistema nervioso, el cambio es inmediato. Estoy muy contenta con el láser. Two years ago, I was, I was learning cranial sacral therapy. And in cranial sacral therapy, there's a rhythm that happens. That rhythm can be seen in the tides in the oceans. That rhythm can be seen and experienced in the body. It's a very subtle, gentle in and out. When that rhythm, when that positive negative, whenever you have positive negative and it comes together, it dissolves into what's called a still point. Polarity, neutrality. Everyone go ahead and try something. Take a big breath in. And as the breath comes out, try to hold on to an area of tension or pain in the body. It's hard. If you really go neutral, if the body really shifts to neutrality, you can't hold on to polarity. Um, about three years ago, I had a very bad nerve injury in my neck, which radiated down my arm. and It was numb, and, and uh, I lost uh, power and strength. And I could I go down and lock down like daily. And I thought I'd lost the use of my arm. My doctor said it, it was nerve damage, couldn't be regenerated. I heard about the laser. I got one. I started working on my nerves up here with Unwind and with the probe, and it took a couple of months, but I have full use of my arm now, and I'm just so excited about this product. I was um, 
given a diagnosis of thinning of the cartilage in the, in the knees, which may be linked to pre-arthritic condition. I believe that's what the um, chief orthopedic surgeon told me. And um, I used my laser, and at, for the last year and a half, two years, I've had no swelling and no discomfort with my knees whatsoever. And I'm really grateful. And in India, I was hanging around with yogis and mystics and these kind of folks. And um, one of them says uh, that they live in the space between the breath. And as soon as I heard that, it was like, yeah, obviously, that's still point. And they use that experience. They also call it the breathless state. They use that experience as literally their reference point for being on planet Earth. Our still point seminars are all about, again, not quantum theory, not any new idea or belief. The purpose of the quantum seminar is to experience first and foremost still point. Quantum Wave founders Paul and Lily Weisbart have embarked on a mission to help people from all over the world to unwind from stress, tension, and dis-ease giving people an opportunity, to, whether using it on them, whether sharing the laser, whether letting them get involved uh, in, in, in for, for them to go and share the laser. For us, it's literally about sharing empowerment for people to start to deal with their own situations, find solutions, unwind, and come back into a state of greater coherence with the universe. With unique products originating in long-proven science, Quantum Wave aims to provide people with a new reference for quantum wellness as we enter the new season here on planet Earth.